Welcome to sunny Los Angeles. I'm going to buy the Lakers. Great for tans. Tell them to win the championship one of these days. Shit for fans. So, we got a deal? One concern, liquidity. We don't have it. Shut up, Frank. We'll have it. We have a deal. Fantastic. We don't have it, by the way. I just promised to pay $67.5 million for the whole shebang. I fucking own this! Red Jerry Bust. Big fan. Well, that won't last long. I doubt that. I love a winner. Well, then you bought the wrong team. No one loses quite like the Lakers. <laughs> I'm here for Dr. Bush. Hi, sorry. He just started on his hair, so it could be a while. Do you want to come in? So your mom's. She's cool. You staying here with Dr. Bust. Yeah, they split up ages ago, so. Your mom's was with him, too? He's my dad. When that loan comes due, this albatross is on the hook. I'm not selling the team. You're giving it away. No fucking way. I'll pay the loan. You're broke. Hi, Jerry. Hey, Paul. I'm really trying my best. Well, I recognize that. I started you my junior year. Number 32. That's right. That's me. I hope you make a better fucking coach. And I appreciate all of your efforts. Thanks. This is bigger than the game. How you comport yourself in the public eye, that's how the world sees all of us. You saying I don't act right? If you want respect, young brother, you have to show some. I have to show some respect. We all calling you Cap, but you ain't leading shit around here. Get in, get in, get in, get in there. Right. Why do you work here? Why do you work at all? I look at my mom. I mean, I love her more than anything, but nobody needs her. Not like people need my dad. And all those years she spent raising us, my dad, he, he spent chasing what he wanted. We'll have celebrities. A new row, right on the floor. For all the cameras, stars of the show. It's showtime. Bring it in, bring it in. Let's go, fellas. Team on three. One, two, three. <laughs> Does it feel the way that you pictured in your head all these years? Better. Is you smile? Oh, there. <laughs> Bill, what hospital are you at? I'm coming. I'm coming. Okay. Jesus fucking Christ. Fuck. Is he gonna make it? Pete, you're coaching the game tomorrow. Just take it easy. I'm fucking cursed. Look at me. You're Gene Kelly. You're Ginger Rogers. Tonight, you're gonna do what? I'm gonna put on my taps, I'm gonna dance. That's right, baby. Gentlemen, I know that our hearts are heavy. There is nothing that Jack McKinney would want more than a win. So let's take a minute. Give sorrow words. The grief that does not speak whispers the orfrot heart and bids it break. So Coach did? No, 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 no. Oh, shit. Sure. No, no, no. Ooh, no. You told me to quit my job for I, this? I, you fucking lied to me. You are not an announcer. You are a coach. You're my coach. I'm your fucking nanny. You want a fucking coach? I don't care what you're talking about. Get up for your fucking team. You want to keep this fucking job? Yeah. So you fucking yell. Yell it. Yeah. There's your fucking wake up call. Now answer it. Yo, what's up, Larry? I'm gonna rip your fucking ass a new hole. Maybe you're all right. I should just stick the plan ball. Maybe. Or you could go out there and beat his ass. They gonna love me then? Fuck. No, they'll double down on his greatness and they'll whisper yours if they say anything at all. That's silence? That's not invisibility. It's power. Oh, 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 oh. Same block from Cheney! I tell you, these refs must be blind. Do? What is you doing? He's the goddamn oh. whistle! Please, ref, please. Cooper trips over his feet. Call it, call it. Nice. Officials are swallowing their whistles once again. Fucking call it! God damn it! This fiddle battle officiating may cost the Lakers the game. <laughs> Just fucking hate me. Nothing but shit. Good morning. Come here. I remember the smile you had on your face first time we broke into this place. I haven't seen that smile. Not for a very long time. Well, you stick around to see us win this thing. You can see it then. You promise. win the 1980 NBA World Championship. You've been an NBA owner all of one year. Must be on top of the world. Whew. Yeah, these guys gave everything they had. Well, this is the end result. 
Now I guess we do it all over again. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. All right. Go ahead. Everyone who said we couldn't do it, you can go fuck.